Hey, here's the basket preview video for Sunday, April 21st. I didn't change the date on there, but this is Easter Sunday, Crucifixion and Resurrection. Whatever happens, remember Jesus is alive. First activity here is crack the egg. So we've got uh, a little game basket here with a bunch of eggs. Approximately three-fourths of these eggs have a little yellow pom-pom, kind of like a cotton ball thing, uh, as like a, an egg yolk. So three-fourths of them have that, about a fourth of them are empty. So as the kids go around, um, they're gonna pick an egg, they take the one that they touch first, and then after they've chosen their egg, ask them to open it over the empty bin, or they can open it over their head or whatever. If the egg they open has water, or in this case, a yellow pom-pom, then they are out. If the egg is empty, then they stay in for another round. So we're gonna play until all the eggs are gone or only one kid remains in the game. And the teaching point on here is, uh, you know, this reminds me of the resurrection story of Mary and Martha visiting Jesus' tomb, thinking Jesus would still be there, but it turned out to be empty. So, fun little game there to review the Easter theme. Uh, next activity is pure of heart. So cut out a large heart out of construction paper. We have that here with our roll of tape. And we're gonna have the kids sit in a circle and then they're gonna pass around the heart. And as it's passed around, they're tearing little pieces off the heart. Uh, probably like quarter sized pieces, like a coin, quarter uh, sized pieces. After the heart has gone around the circle and everyone has a piece, have them all place their pieces in the middle of the circle and then they can kind of uh, work together to put the heart back together, but do not provide them with any tape or glue. And then eventually um, after someone suggests tape, we do have the roll of tape there that you can use. So the discussion point with that is that everyone sins and does things against what God asks of us. Our sins hurt ourselves and others. However, we ask him, God will forgive us of our sins and make our hearts like new again. So there's a discussion point there on that activity. Next, eggtastic verse. So you're going to use the Easter eggs from that first activity and have the kids uh, take enough eggs to fill in. I think there's 12 slips in this forms in this world. You will have trouble. Uh, our monthly memory verse. So fill in 12 of the eggs, one slip per egg, and then uh, maybe you can divide your team into two, and then have one group kind of shuffle the eggs, and then the other group uh, it has to work together to try to put them together, and then you can refill the eggs and switch. Last activity is the cross cards activity. So I have these cards that are just very simply, you have a cross cut out on the front, and then on the inside, uh, we're gonna have the kids take this, I guess it's called washi tape, or it's like decorative tape. It's kind of like masking tape, but it has kind of like some neat patterns to it. So the kids are gonna take the tape on this part here and just tape different lines and kind of create like a pattern of different, um, you know, designs and all that. And then it kind of looks messy, but then as the card uh, gets closed, then the cross will kind of cover that design and it kind of clears it up a little bit. And of course, there's a good discussion point with that one as well. So those are your four activities for Easter Sunday. Thank you, I'll see you on Sunday.